Hello friends, it's me Jilin Corner. This is the 17th chapter in the Java FX 3D development tutorial series. In the previous chapter, we learned how to add a 2D component like image view into the 3D scene. In this chapter, we will add a 2D slider component which can be used for controlling the z-axis of the earth. So let us start doing it. Okay, so this is where we left off. This is our previous code. What we have to do is we have to create a slider component just like we prepared this image view. So let me do that right now. So private slider, we have a Java FX dot scene control slider, and I am adding using prepare prepare slider. And here I can simply create a slider using slider slider equals new slider, and then I need to set the parameter. So we need a minimum and maximum value for the slider, right? So I'm going to set the maximum value of the slider to 800. That is that is not strictly bound. You can give your own value. This will be the maximum set axis value we can give using this slider. So right now my image view depth is 800. So I just set the slider maximum to 800 so that I can move the earth to a maximum set axis translation of 800 and slider dot set minimum and I, I also can set the minimum value right now i'm going to set that to minus 400 then and then i need to set the width of the slider uh, the width of the actual slider component so slider dot set preferred width and i prefer giving a 300 300 width then i need to set the x and y values of the slider remember just like when we added the image view this will be located at the center for example if this was the 3d scene then it will be created from here to here so it, it will not be actually centered it will be created at the center so we have to move it we have to move it half in the x-axis in the reverse direction so set layout x similar to what we have done here here we moved it moved it half of the width of the image in the x-axis similarly we have to move it half of the width in the x-axis which is minus 150 then we have to set the y-axis so set layout y and currently it will be located at the center of the screen i want to move it a little bit downward so i'm going to give it as 200 plus then what i have to do is simply return this slider so so far we just prepared a 2d slider and now we have to add it to the group of uh, the group that is the root so here I'm going to take the slider, prepare slider, and I'm sorry, I forgot to give the variable name. So slider slider equals prepare slider. And similar to what we have done with the image view, we can simply add it to the children. So here I'm going to add it the slider just like this. And if I run this program right now, uh, we, we should see the slider but it will not do anything that is because we haven't handled the event so we have a slider just like this but it doesn't work so let us make it work shall we uh, the first thing that we have to do is to bind this slider value with the set axis of this world object so when we move the slider the set value of the world will also change which can be then using this way so we have the translate c property and we can bind it with the slider value property so these two values are now bound to each other and then we have to add one more thing uh, uh, the thing is currently it is in white color and we can't really see the labels in the image in order to see them properly we have to give a black theme or we have to make the components black let me show you by running it again uh, as you see here we can't really see it sometimes the uh, slider component i mean that uh, white this thing this white thing is going away when we move it like this we got the control when we move the slider the earth is uh, at set axis is changing so the component is working fine but the ui doesn't look good so let us make it better 
the, the thing we can do here is setting the style property so I am going to write one single CSS here FX base and we set it to black color so what we are trying to do is uh, we are telling this uh, Java FX that the base color of the scene is black so it will adjust everything else according to that color and one other thing I have to do is to show the tick labels so slider dot set show tick labels and we make it true so we can see the labels after certain intervals and we have to set a slider set property so slider dot set translate c property and i'm going to set the set property to something like five and if i run this program right now it will be much much better than previous run see we got a nice tick marks and this labels that is coming because of the uh, set show tick labels we have given and we got the component in black color because we told that the background style the base style we want is the black and everything else is fine i think we have the total control of the earth using this slider so it is working very fine so that's guys that's the end of this chapter we saw how to prepare the earth and we saw how to add 2d components to the 3d scenes and that's about the pretty much basics of the Hawaii face ready. So as always, thank you for watching this video. Like the video if you like it. And I will see you on the next chapter.